Good evening guys and happy Saturday to all of your sunshiny faces. Guys, this is so weird. This is the first Saturday where my mom is not working. Um, although she, again, had her um, like uh, procedure done on Thursday. She had a little trouble like getting up and getting around and things like that. So we've been having to help her. Um, but she is, you know, I told you guys she ended up getting a new job where now she's working Tuesdays and Thursdays instead of um, on the weekends, night shift, which was you know kind of compromised a lot of the things that we could get done so while she was actually sleeping today it was almost weird it was kind of like she was like going to work because like she was sleeping like during the day um but that was again too because she wasn't feeling that great and um you know had, not, had nothing to do with the fact that she was going to work tonight because she wasn't but um me and my dad today during the day um we had a two two or three errands we actually had to run this morning um and then after that we ended up uh cleaning out the attic um I did wind up getting to a handful of other things I actually I had like five eggs left in a carton and I was like and plus I just bought those um eggs or my dad did yesterday at um at Caputo's so I was like honestly I kind of want to get the eggs like just the five eggs that I had that were in there used up so I actually used six one from the other dozen but um, I ended up doing that and made like a little egg bake for breakfast this morning for everybody. Um, and then we ended up um, doing, uh, I got this stuff out for freezer, the freezer dinners I was going to make. We ended up doing meatball sandwiches for everybody for dinner tonight. And then tomorrow we're going to grill hamburgers. Um, and so, because it's supposed to be like 50 degrees out tomorrow, which is super nice. So I got um, everybody else's frozen freezer, like hamburgers out of the freezer. Um, and then I'm going to get some, I think pick some up at Aldi tomorrow of my Beyond Beef burgers because I'm actually out. So I'm going to pick some of those up. But we are going to grill that tomorrow since it's going to be so nice out. So I ended up doing that kind of earlier in the day today. And then me and my dad ended up going up in the attic for a while today. And I actually, I think I told you guys, I was like, I felt like we were still so far away from actually being done with the stuff in the attic. I realized we're actually, we were a lot closer than I thought we were. I thought there was like a whole nother kind of, not mound of stuff, but I thought there was a whole nother like kind of section of stuff. And I realized that most of it was where our like um, holiday decorations are in the attic um all that stuff in there was like I thought like there's a clothing rack that's like in there too that has stuff that's hanging up in it and I thought that there was more stuff behind that but there really wasn't um so I have I think like I've re-evaluated kind of the situation <laughs> and realized that we don't actually have that much left to go through or that much to like put away of things and stuff um and so that's really awesome so there's still kind of a handful of things that like need to be gone through and kind of organized and put and situated in the right spot but then after that um I actually think we're kind of done so it was really good to actually get back up there and kind of get that done but what we did end up doing was there's like probably nothing like really loose sitting on the ground anymore I would say up in the attic we got all that taken care of like there was a couple of like boxes that were broken down but not recycled <laughs> so I don't know why they were still up there and like a couple of again that I, from what I could see like loose things kind of around up there we got actually all of that taken care of it looks like um and again we were able to kind of get all of that stuff out in this kind of one section of the attic so we ended up doing that which was super awesome and one of the things that my mom had pointed out too um was that we got that ring doorbell we have a ring doorbell and two ring security like um not security cameras they are the security cameras but they're like the motion sensor lights um so we wanted to replace one of the ones that's on our backyard and also our side our side door um and then also to our we were going to do the ring doorbell on the front door um, because although sometimes people, especially Amazon, randomly a lot of the time, is weird though. I actually think UPS does this more than Amazon and like our regular like, um, like, you know, postal mail. Um, they normally go to our front door. For some reason, I think UPS always goes to our side door. I don't know why. Sometimes randomly, like Amazon might like they might end up going to the side door but for the most part everything gets delivered to the front door um but sometimes things will get delivered there and we won't know and we'll be like I think we didn't get this or you know something happened or whatever and then we're like oh wait no it's at the side door so um and just also to like for security and stuff like that too that focuses like on our driveway um and so you know we can watch like our driveway and then the ring doorbell so like we kind of have all of our bases hit like with those three in that area 
area and the two um the only thing is with the side door um is that we have to move i think the box over a little bit because our door actually opens out our our side door opens out um and so because of that though it has in the past hit the um floodlights and actually broken them like they've shattered so we don't want to have that happen so i think what we're going to do is move it either to the other side of the door um or we're going to wind up moving it further down so that that doesn't happen um and so we have to do a little bit more to be able to get to that um and then the ring doorbell we have it wired which my dad thinks that there might be a, a like electric there anyway and if not he's an electrician so he can easily run like electric from the like the light is there the outside light um or you know whatever and there's like an outlet right on the other side anyway so what for whatever reason he can run it but we probably have to do it from the attic side so the fact that everything is like cleaned over there my dad can easily get to it and just kind of run the wiring i think down from the top is what he's gonna do so that's a whole like kind of a probably a full weekend project like we probably want to do it on Saturday not on Sunday um, and so we are thinking of just installing the one in the garage on the garage like um, like uh, tomorrow and then we have to like I said get a little bit more do a little bit more detail and the other two but the one in the backyard we shouldn't have any problems with because my dad actually too we were having a problem with the motion sensor lights. We got, we actually recently replaced it um, like a handful of years ago. Like I want to say it was maybe 2020. Um, I think we were doing a whole bunch of the backyard kind of update stuff. And what my dad ended up doing was the box for it was too high up. So it was actually hitting like the roof kind of. So my dad moved the box further down. Um, and then we replaced the brand new um, like, you know, light fixture, which is again, only like two, three years old. But one of the lights just burned out in it. Um, and so my dad was like, well, it's a perfect time because we got the ring door or the ring, um, like light. So, um, we're going to replace that and then have that in the backyard anyway. So that should be super, super insanely easy. It's literally just wiring up the light and then obviously having to download the app and figure all that stuff out. But, um, that will actually be the very easy part is just doing the garage one for right now. So we're thinking we can probably do that. It's supposed to be warm tomorrow. Like I said, 52 degrees, I think was what they were saying. Um, and then if we do have enough time, we can also maybe work on the attic just a little bit more. We have a couple things that we can maybe try and focus on getting taken care of up there um, and spend like maybe because <clears throat> honestly, we only ended up working up there for maybe like two hours in total but we got a bunch of stuff done like once I finally started figuring out like okay we don't have that much left so, like I thought there was still a lot more left but once I started realizing it I was like this actually can kind of go pretty quickly because there was a bin of stuff that I thought was like more stuff that had to be go gone through I realized this is a box of Easter stuff and I was like that's coming downstairs pretty soon <laughs> anyway like we're not gonna have to worry about that I think we have a box of St. Patrick's Day stuff too that's up there that was like this can also come down but they weren't with the holiday decorations I don't know why they were like moved somewhere else so I was like this is actually easy and we can just get it moved back to like the holiday area that we have all that stuff anyway so I was like honestly we can probably get this done pretty quickly and pretty easily um and you know like I said a handful of other things just kind of taking care of and handled that are up in the attic right now I told you guys the big step for us is finishing the attic so that we can temporarily move some stuff that is in the upstairs into the attic so that we can move people around so that we can finish doing our like attic upstairs like remodel thing kind of um so long story short um we ended up getting a really good amount of stuff done today up there which i was super happy about um and like i said too i was like how are we really only up there for two hours it felt like we were up there for like not forever but i just felt like the amount of stuff that we got done it should have taken us a lot longer and i was like really like we were only up there for two hours like i feel like the amount of stuff that we got done i feel like for how much we got done i'm like really like we should have <laughs> it should have taken us a lot longer but you know we were just really productive and we got done with it really quickly so or also too there wasn't quite as much as like my brain was envisioning was still up there so that could have also been why so anyways I'm hoping to like I said maybe get to those two things tomorrow at least hopefully maybe the ring doorbell um or the ring light and then also to the maybe a little bit more upstairs cleaning stuff that we can kind of get taken care of and handled and you know that kind of thing so that would be really awesome um <clears throat> like I was saying if we can get to maybe some of that as well but all in all 
we've got you know like i said like space now cleared and cleaned out to temporarily store some of those things because like i was telling you guys we're gonna have to move jack downstairs in my mom's office some of my mom's office stuff's gonna have to come upstairs in the attic so that jack can stay in there temporarily and then again too my mom can come out um you know some of her stuff can come out of her office and we can put it upstairs for the time being and then we can um you know like i said get a lot of that upstairs room taken care of and handled and that kind of thing so that would be really awesome um like i said if we can you know now we have our weekends free because i felt like it was taking us a really long time to get this stuff done and i was like how are we supposed to manage this with my mom having to sleep during the day on the weekends and us having to be quiet because she you know is working night shifts it was just super super um difficult especially when we're trying to you know trying to get to a point where we can do a renovation upstairs and we're not able to right now um because you know we can't even get to just like boxes moved without making too much noise and like waking her up so um you know like i said we'd have to get to that point at you know a certain time and it's just it's tough it's difficult and so um now that like i said that's not the case anymore we can you know again we were up there for you know a good portion of the day um you know during the day being able to work on that so that was nice but um anyways guys i will see you all in tomorrow's vlog if you guys did enjoy today's make sure you guys give a big old thumbs up if you guys are new we'd love if you'd subscribe and i'll see all of your sunshiny pieces tomorrow so bye guys